beautiful peaches of the earth I am back with another video back in the groove of making these gaming videos pretty excited to do them um, I really like this new style I'm going for but anyways after this video we are going to hit the middle of the legacy challenge and that means I'm halfway through being finished with this and then I can finally start doing other things that I wanted to do Hopefully do another challenge, I don't know. But anyways, so for this generation, I decided to have him have kids early. And so the backstory is, in his mom's will, after she died, um, it stated that he has the rights to this house, so that's why he's still living in the same place. And anyways, so he already found a partner. It's Luna. She's one of the default sims. But um, later you'll see that she changes because I changed her look instead. I kept her traits the same, but her looks are entirely different. So I just moved her in, and then they became roommates. Um, and then he proposed her after a while. Um, so this is me. Uh, this is the clip of me having them propose to each other. Of course. I wanted them to dress nice for this to make it look like they were on a date because, um, you know, just proposing to someone like this, it's, it's not that great. But yeah, so as you see here, I changed her entire look. I made her blonde because I realized I really only have brunettes. So I wanted to mix things up. Um, the next legacy, the boo is not gonna be white, just so y'all know. Um, but yeah, so there they are, they got engaged, congratulations! And now here's a clip of them eloping, because you all know me, I don't like to do the whole ceremony, because it's just so much work. Yeah, so... Um, if you don't remember, his aspiration was joke star, so that's why he looks like this. He kind of looks like a comedic relief type of person, if you think about it. But later on, I changed his looks, and the backstory is, well, as you see, Luna's very fashionable and stuff, so she rubbed off of him, and he got better looking, I guess. Um, but yeah. So, that's a clip of her expecting a baby, um, and now here's a clip of her having her first child. Uh, her name was Scarlet. Spoiler alert, she was in the air, um, which, thankfully, you'll know why later, thankfully. Um, but yeah, so, as you see, uh, actually you don't see, but they're still young adults when they had the kids, so I wanted to have it early on just because... I made the mistake of having them later in the last generation, so I didn't want to make that mistake again, so this time I did it earlier, which I guess turned out kind of not that great because it overlapped between generations, so my teen that became the heir ended up being a young adult by the time he died and she already like went through a few of her life but detail so anyways this is just more clips I don't actually have a lot of clips of them playing just because I didn't record it at all but I did record the important part so for some reason I can't find a happy medium between recording my gameplays and recording the important parts so, I don't know. I think I like this better just because I don't know what you would expect from me doing gameplay because it's pretty much the same thing, just me keeping up with everything and then making them get promotions and I'm pretty sure those of you who play Sims already know how to do this, so I'm not going to show it um, unless you want me to, but yeah. So here's the clip of her having her second child. This child's name is Tiffany, I believe. Um, 
yeah so they had two girls and I decided to have the girls be close in age so I think a day after Scarlett was born they went to have a baby and then this baby was born three days later so you know the timing is three days and so yeah here is Tiffany and then I just you know this is just it this is Tiffany and then I aged her up um, and then you saw a clip of me doing the random generator generator and so this is Tiffany um, she has a very boyish look so I went with that usually for looks I go with the default looks and play off of that so whatever their style seems to be like that's what their style will be when it's our random generized but I make them look more stylish you know so here is a clip of Scarlett aging up I didn't have um, a clip of Scarlett becoming a toddler so sorry but her trait was independent um, but yeah, so here's the clip of me aging her up to a child. Um, and then you have that extra clip of me random generating her traits. So you know I'm not cheating. I'm doing, I'm playing the game by the rules. Um, yeah, so she aged up. And then I believe this is the clip of Tiffany aging up. For some reason, the kids, once they aged up to child they they got black in this next clip you'll see that she'll have black hair but uh where are her eyebrows <laughs> anyways here is the next clip which is scarlet aging up and this is where she becomes a teen and this is where you'll see why i was believed she was not the heir because girl Okay, so here's the random trait generator. You'll see me doing what you're supposed to do, following the rules, and so she ages up, and guess what her trait is? It's mean. It's the mean trait. I know my clip is taking a while, but it's the mean trait. So, yeah, she gets the mean trait, and look what happened. She destroyed everything in the kitchen. You know who the culprit is? Her. Scarlet. Her. <sighs> Thank God she was not the heir, honestly. Um, so now here's the clip of Tiffany aging up. Um, she got the self-assured trait. I really like this very much. Um, but, again, what is that makeup, right? Don't worry, I fixed her up. She looks pretty good now, and I uh, changed her hair and everything. Here's a clip of me kicking out Scarlet. Thank God. I don't like taking care of so many Sims at once. Um, I didn't have a video of me aging her up, but yeah. So now, goodbye to Lucas, and this is the end of Generation 4. Um... I hope you enjoyed the video. I know it was just a bunch of important parts and it wasn't that great, but there was a few funny clips. Um, I remember to record them. So yeah, here to a moment of silence for Lucas who is dying now. Honestly, I find it really funny how his wife was just eating while he died. Anyways, if you enjoyed the video, remember to follow, follow me on Instagram. Thumbs it up if you enjoyed it. And click, click, click to subscribe. Thank you, and I'll see you next time.